Hello guys, today I'm going to change my uh, standard uh, screw with an ordinary Philips 2 head to this nice uh, security bit screw I got from AliExpress. The old Volkswagen is uh, prone to steal and it's easy to steal and people are even stealing parts from them I have heard. So, uh, they are taking the backlight, taillights and the indicators. So uh, to make it a little harder, I will try this one, see if it helps. Another thing is that the original screw is very long. So um, I will change them to this one, which fits better. I have uh, changed this uh, screw earlier to some acid, acid proof screws, stainless steel. But they are still way too long when you have the correct correct dimensions so um, hopefully this one should do let's see I need to change the bulb inside here as well because that one is not working anymore I have this um, driving light uh, switchback indicator bulbs which uh, is uh, amber and white and where did I put the... These bulbs only lasted for about a year. So I have now ordered a new one, new type. Provide links for it up here so you can check it out. Same with the screws. So, let's see. Here we go. Okay, let's get in the car and test the bulb. Let's see if you can hear me all the way. Oh, I'm inside the car, closing the door, putting in the ignition, and testing the lights. And here we go. And then indicating. Looking good from my side. Switching off. And there it goes back. Indicating. Switch off. And it switch back to driving light. Excellent. Eh? Yeah. <laughs> Amazing. Okay, let us get out of the car again. And uh, here we are. Hopefully you can hear what I say because of this uh, microphone, wireless microphone. And hopefully also you see this one. So let's continue. Then to the exciting part, the new screws. It's a Torx um, TX25 with a security bit with a hole in the mi middle. Let's see if it's one. Yes, looks like to be the perfect length. <laughs> Amazing, eh? I ordered uh, 20 pieces. You might only need one for each side to secure them, but I will change all all screws on every indicator and every tail light. Ah, look at that. Amazing. Let me show you in the close-up. I also have a new camera, which is uh, Pocket 2 from DJI. Let me see if I can flip this around. I think it was this one. Yeah. And then you can hopefully see the screws with the nice uh, torque security bits. Amazing, the nice, eh? And then three push of a button, and we are back. The camera also has this uh, microphone, which is uh, wireless. You can see it's a green LED when it's on. And if I switch this off, it will connect the microphone over here. So hopefully you should hear a difference in the sound right now. Switch it back on. Green, let's see. If it's connecting, yes, it's connected. And then we are back on the wireless mic. Fantastic, eh? <laughs> That's one done. Three to go. Okay, the taillight screws are the same one as on the front. No, this was, was a more appropriate size, actually. But still, I will change them to this uh, stainless steel one. Let's see. 
Yes, they have the same same length. Ah, look how nice that looks. Fantastic. And then let's flip you around again. One, two, three. And here we go. See, there we have it. Very nice, eh? <laughs> Looks amazing. No rust, only shiny screws. And if you look at this one. Uh, where are we? There we are. Rust, rust. Let's change them as well. Okay guys, this clip is uh, pinned with this uh, very nice little uh, gimbal. This is a DJI uh, Pocket 2, which I love very much. This one also has this um, wireless microphone with a dead cat on. Highly recommended. I will provide links for it down below and up in the corner so you can check it out for yourself. Excellent camera. And look at this. Three push on this button. One, two, three. Huh? Nice, eh? <laughs> Amazing. Okay, guys, there you have it. New screws. Everything should be nice and secure. Thanks for watching. Hope to see you in the next one. Goodbye.